Hey guys, Marble Mar here, and we are back with Kerbal Space Program. The last episode didn't go too well, but in this episode, now that we have. Ugh, excuse me. Uh, now that we have better SAS, we are going to attach it to our last rocket, which I believe was this. Um, yeah, looks like it. Alright. Load this bad boy up, and then we have to change a couple things and send it back into space. Alright. So, first things first. Take that part off. Um, I can't take. Alright, hold on. First, let's take off the parachute. And then, take off the RCS. Then, in command and control, advanced inline stabler. There we go. So, we move that down. Put that there. Put that there. And then we put that on top. And for some reason that got out of order. Alright. So, now the next part. The RCS. Hold on. Actually, do we have mono repellent tanks now? Yes, we do. Alright. Now we need to attach. I say we attach four on here. And also we take this part off and check the weight. So now the weight is like directly in the middle, so can I use this to drag it down? Yes I can. Let's have it so that way it's right in the middle there. Uh, let's move that around. Here we go. Alright. RCS. For RCS. And we connect that. Now the weight's all the way down here. All right. Now, let's see. What part's gonna get me into space? Let's see. This part should be gone by the time I get into the space. So let's put more RCS on there. All right. And let's bring you back. And we'll snap it stuck on again. Alright, so, let's make sure everything's set. Yep, 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 yep. We are good to go. Mach 2. Save. Hold on, we have to make sure. Nope, we are not using Jebediah. We're using Tenless. Alright. Let's save and launch. Okay. So. I don't think I'm gonna try turning again. I think I'm just gonna go straight up. <clears throat> and then, once I'm out of, once the entire bottom part is gone, I'll turn on RCS and stuff. Alright. So. I forgot to put clamps on it again, but. Let's make do. Alright. So let's turn SAS on. No throttle and launch. Okay. Let's just check a crew report real quick. Okay. All right. So far, so good. Unfortunately. Doesn't look like our sod feels doing too well. Cause usually we're like at least almost out of the at, uh, lower atmosphere with solid fuel. <clears throat> but also now that we have more stuff on it, it makes us heavier. So we're gonna get even less farther out. I wonder if we should try 
if I wonder, well, I'm thinking if we put clamps, it'll already be up in the air and it'll be able to just shoot off. Unless if I decouple it and it just drops down and blows up. <clears throat> Alright, well, it looks like we're gonna get about halfway out. Which is okay, I guess. Alright. Alright, okay, to get ready to couple. Alright. And cut, decouple, and go up. There we go, perfect. They all just exploded. And we're going to stay going up. Alright, let's check. You know, make sure the nav ball is up just in case our orbit starts going crazy and then I can use a uh, use RCS but looks like everything is going perfectly So this is about the point where I tried to turn last time and failed horribly. So I'm not going to turn here, but I will set a maneuver node once this reaches, I'd say, 50,000. Now I'll set a maneuver no mo node when I'm in space. How about that? Right, so we got plenty of time before we reach that. Tanlis looks a little bit scared. But he shouldn't be because he's in capable hands. Not really. Alright. Let's off that. Alright. We're going to be decoupling soon. Alright. Our orbit is almost at 50,000 meters. Okay. Alright, it's at 50,000. I'm gonna stay going up though. We are traveling at almost 800 meters per second. We're making excellent time. And then also, the middle fuel tank still has so much fuel in it. Alright. We're gonna, re we're gonna break 1000 meters per second. Right. We gotta decouple in a couple seconds. And we gotta decouple right now. Decouple. Alright, we're still going fast. We're still picking up speed too. Let's see what happens if I cut that. Alright, we'll still go up. Alright. See if I can. So let's set maneuver node right there to do. Let's see, I want to try and. Nope, what, where'd you go? Alright, come on. I want to try and get this around the planet in one shot all right and it's orbit right hold on how far is this 50,000 50, and all oh, right that is really not good all right so let's make that a little there 1,000 100 all right so obviously I'm going to have to Oh, we're in space now. Alright. So now if I boost here, it'll push that out. If I boost here, it'll push this out. 
Alright, so this is good. So let's turn on RCS. An attempt to move to the node. Alright. Just gotta be very careful. Okay. Alright. Little more. And. Good. I'm going to quick save right here. Because we are doing good so far. Alright. So now. I'm definitely going to have to shrink this. But if I can get over there. If I can make this orbit. We might get uh, orbit Kerbin. That would be amazing. Alright. So we have a couple more seconds. We know SES stay on. We can turn RCS off. Right, our speed is going down a lot. How much? How are we doing on fuel? All right. Our our model repellent, which is RCS, is doing perfectly good. We're a little bit dead. All right, stop talking. All right. So T minus five, four, three, two, one. Fire. All right. Wow, we got to burn for three minutes. Alright, I think we have enough fuel for that. Alright. I'm gonna move that down. Because I need this to just launch straight away. So that way, it's not like we slow down. And then we start moving back down. And then we launch again and then it's not a stable orbit. I want to try and have as much fuel as possible so that way we can make it smaller and then also I still want more fuel so that way we can head back down into earth alright we have two more minutes of burn left Looks good so far. Our ship is stable. We're gonna we're gonna lose this this huge huge uh pod though. We have exactly two minutes left, and I don't think that's enough fuel to get there on this tank. So we're definitely gonna be losing that. But we might have enough to. Oh, I think we're wibble wobbling. No, I think it's just textures clipping. All right. All right. If we can get to a minute thirty left, we might be good. All right. Yeah, we got this. All right. Let's quick save, just in case. And go. There we go. Delayed start. Oh, now our time is down though. Because this isn't as strong as an engine. But we are picking up speed. And this is a really fuel efficient engine.
I think we got this. I mean, just in case, we do have a quick save. Alright. We're going faster than the distance we have left to make. Our time is decreasing. Like, the distance is decreasing. We are almost around the planet, just about. Alright. If this works, I'm gonna be so happy. We will have achieved what we've been trying to achieve for the past couple episodes now. And also we will have done it with a level zero pilot. And also, if this isn't a success, I'll do it again with Jebediah, so that way he, get, he levels up. Like, I'm doing that off-screen, though. Because if it fails, I'm probably going to be mad, and you... And I don't want people to see that. <laughs> Alright, um... We're still picking up speed. We still have two minutes left. Let's see, if we can reach 2,500 meters, it'd be awesome. Get more money. We are at 12... 125,000 meters. Alright. Oh. Our height's decreasing, though. Why is... Oh, because we're going down. But it's gonna come around and then push out more, hopefully. We're still picking up speed. So we might we might be able to achieve speeds exceeding two two thousand five hundred meters per second. Let's see, this is going sixty k, and I have no idea what that even means. Ooh, our maneuver mode moved a little bit. There we go. Oh, we're almost around the planet. We're getting close. And I think we might achieve the speed. We might do it. Come on. I want to achieve the speed, get into an orbit, and I will call this a success. But we are definitely going down. Alright. So now this is gonna come around. Alright. But now we should start going back up, I think. Alright, are we going back up? No, we're still going down. Not, hopefully not for much longer. And I think we might make... Oh, we got... We're in an orbit. Alright. Let's just achieve the speed. I don't need this anymore. Let's just achieve the speed that I want to get, and then... I'll cut it. I cut the... Engine. And then I'll take our little measurements and then I'll go back in or I could leave them up there for a little bit alright come on 100 more meters I mean 100 more meters per second speed alright our orbit is at a hundred and then 500, alright. It's not the best orbit. Alright, we might get there. Yeah! Wait. 2,500. Why didn't I get credit for it?
Let's just keep burning for a little bit. Hmm. Oh well. You're in an orbit. 204 6. Let's quick save. Alright. So let's zoom in right now. Now, I'm not making the mistake of letting you out, because. reasons. And I'll see. Alright. So now, if I observe materials bay, is that those gonna blow up? Nope! They're perfectly fine. It's affected the growth of crystalline structures. Loose objects are also flying around. Alright. We got zero things if we transmit that data, so let's not transmit. Alright. Can we turn the lights? Yeah! Gears can go down. Alright. Mystery goo. The goo seems to have clumped into sphere. It also seems to have become brittle. Alright. Crew report. Alright. No, I want to get that. There we go. Nope. Alright. Is that everything that we can possibly do? Yeah. Alright. Let's quick save again. And I'm going to warp till we are over on the other side. So our highest point is 251. I mean 651. Right. Now actually, to make this easier, let's click on there. Warp here. There we go. And now we won't have to worry about it going too fast, and then we crash, and then blow up and die. Alright, and then it slows us down. Alright, and now I'm going to do... Oh! Electrical charge is going down. Alright, let's turn off lights. Because that's draining everything. Alright. Um, Alright, so crew report is still the same. Let's reset the goo canister. Observe mystery goo. Alright, goo feels right at home. We get more for that. Log temperature. Okay, 24. That's good. Reset materials bay. Observe materials bay. Alright. Save again. Because we got, we're gonna get a bunch of signs from this. This is awesome. All right. So now let's warp to when we are at our lowest point. And then we're gonna boost towards the planet. Now, just so that I don't mess up. All right, hold on. Let's cancel the time warp and put it right here. There we go. Alright. Now at our lowest point, we are going to add a maneuver to zoom. Let's try and get it so that we land on land. Alright, so that should be good. So now we turn our CS on. So now once we go over here, we're going to boost and hopefully land on here. 
So now we also the earth is tilting this way, so we might land in the water. Yeah, that's gonna be a problem. So let's shrink it until we are just on land. Okay. Let's move a little bit. Turn RCS off. Alright. FN F5. And now let us warp. Right. All right. We have ten. T minus ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. All right. These. Th I don't think this is how. I think this is going way slower than. A seconds actually is four, three, two, one, and burn. Our right, orbit is coming back in. As long as we, as long as our orbit closes and we're back on Earth, we are good. So far, so good. All right, our lowest point is at 104. Our highest point is at 200. All right. Seems like our apoapsis, which is our highest point, is going down faster than our lowest point. So that means this is going to flip soon. Once this gets low enough. All right, it's flipping. And complete flip. Doesn't look like we're gonna get land on land. Oh, we are running out of fuel though. Alright, we are just almost on the earth. And we are back on the earth. Alright. Probably gonna have to keep burning until I don't have any more fuel. Yeah, I'm gonna run out of fuel. Which means I'll just keep burning until I'm out of fuel. Fuel is going to be out. All right. Decouple. Quick save. We're now heading back down to Earth. All right. Let's turn on our lights. Let's see how fast that drains. Although we are in the sun, so turn it off now. All right, so now let's warp. Yeah, we're gonna land in water. Oh well. All right, all right, all right. We want to be pointing straight up. And close enough. Alright. Oh, right, wrong button. So, I wonder if we could take another water sample. Actually, I wonder if I can swim to land. 
I wonder if that'll be a good idea. Alright. Alright, let's turn SAS off now. Alright, once we hit the lower atmosphere, we are going to... Oh, Ooh, we almost overheated. Alright, so we've survived burn-in, that's good. Alright, let's zoom up a little bit. Doesn't look like we're close to any land. Closest land is the little island over here. I wonder if I turn on RCS, can I try to move it forward? Nope. Alright. Let's launch the parachute once we are at 2,000 meters. This is almost successful. Alright. Let's send it out now. Because also I need this bottom part to survive. Alright. And parachutes should activate soon. Like, pull up. I'd be right now. Oh no. Oh! That was a close one. Everything's still intact? Nope. Darn it. Lost our bottom part. Oh well, we survived! Close enough! Victory! Alright! Although we didn't get our Science Junior back alive, at least we came back alive. And also, we might still get credit, even though it's broken. Let's see, I know that gave us. Temperature, Mr. Nope, we didn't get it back. Alright. Got a bunch of money. Talus had advanced to level 1. Alright, good. So. Alright. Okay, so now SAS will work better for him. Alright. So now I'm gonna have to train him later. Or maybe I should just use Tanless. I don't know. Alright, but we have succeeded in our mission. And I don't think we could buy anything because... Unfortunately, we lost a little bit of science. Yeah, we can't crash any... I mean, bleh. Can't get anything. Alright, but I think next episode we can get a space station. But also, actually... I plan on installing mods. I think we should do mods. Wait. So now, it's, now it says we don't have a contract. What, what was this one? <laughs> it doesn't say that we have a speed one. Maybe we already completed it. Oh well. Alright, but we... Right. It doesn't say we have any active. That speed record. Do we have any speed record? Right. Speed record of a thousand. No. Speed. That's. Hmm. That's weird. But we now have more missions. Position a satellite in a 
Kiyosuk. I have no idea what that is. Please note that the following must be an, a new unmanned probe built for the agency after the contract is accepted. Or specifics. Apoapsis must be 3,174. Pre inclined. Longitude. Ooh, that is... That is a tricky one. Alright, but then we have to test the launch escape system in flight over Kerbin. So we could try that later. Then we have those. And then we have a s Explore the Mun. As a consequence of another unintegrated into. Alright. Um. Advance, achieve orbit around the Mun. We get stuff for that. Transmit or recover scientific data from space around the Mun. Then land on the Moon. And transmit or receive from the surface. Okay. So there's a lot of things that we can do. And then we have to perform temperature scans. Temperature scan at sector. I have no idea what those are. But whatever. Alright. So we have completed our mission for today, and tomorrow, I mean, next time we are going to install mods, and have a good time with that. Alright, so, thank you all for watching, please like, subscribe, to come up with it today, and I'll see you guys next time.